Colin Cole. Um, I work primarily with images related to um, memory. My work is essentially autobiographical with idiosyncratic behavioural patterns found in them. The work behind me here is um, not a political image, although it carries the significance of political um, imagery uh, within its context, but it is more related to personal identity of experiences that I have through various encounters in my life have collected. I'm an avid collector from an early childhood. I used to collect things that became significant for me as, as a person that earmarked a kind of a road map for um, things that one sees and kind of believes in and has a tangible kind of relic. I'm not, I'm not a collector as such, but a, a habitual um, accumulator of what other people would see as insignificant objects. The work behind me is about a period of my life which I spent in the military. Um, I find it very appropriate that it is in the reservoir because it is suppressed, it, is, it has been put underground. Um, wherever it's been exhibited before has never carried the significance of this now. This is a hideaway, it's almost a, a mausoleum for the work itself. So coming here yesterday and putting the work up became an important event for me in that this was the first time it, it carried the justification for me doing the work. Um, the work behind you on the wall is an accumulation collage built from um, history and it's associated thing of what people do and it's called the unrestricted organization of an average man. Then on the table around you are all items and um, kind of symbols of things that I've collected that I see and can date in memory. Although memory by its, by its nature is a reconstructive um, idea and it's strongly um, incorrect because it's a narrative and every time you tell a story, the narrative changes and you depending on who, who you're talking to, how you actually allow that narrative to unfold. Each time this work has been on exhibition, it has changed significantly in terms of what I've added to it, what I've taken out of it, and what I've included through new accumulations. Um, some of the accumulations for these, which I call flashcards for memory recollection, um, are things that happened to me recently and they become triggers. It's like when you walk into a room, you smell something and suddenly you're nine years old again. So they, these are significant triggers for me and they help to contextualize my reality.